three stops away from this bus stop. Oh. That's a bit crazy. Do you hear that? Yeah. Right now? <laughs> uh, where are we? We are in Tuksom. Tuksom. Tuksom is on the line number two, the green line. Yeah. It's the line that goes in a circle. And it passes a lot of the universities like Hongdae wow. University, Hanyang wow. University, Gongguk University, Seoul de Chinagana, maybe. <laughs> and took some here, we're really close to the Han River. The river we passed. Yeah, the big way. river that yeah. goes through Seoul. Did you know that I swam inside the Han River? No. <laughs> yeah, I crossed Han River by swimming. When did you do that? Two summers ago. I swam in the Han River. Okay. Yeah, it was fun. Today, we're gonna go eat Oysters! Have you tried oysters before? No. No, right? I, I don't think so anyway, maybe as a child, but... I tried oysters, but like one oyster, uh, <laughs> because oysters are so expensive. I've had mussels before, though. Yeah, mussels. But they're... Mussels we eat a lot in Belgium. Belgium yeah. So, well. Yeah, we'll take the bus and then the subway, and we're gonna go and eat some yummy food. <laughs> what is this weird thing? Uh, that's a smart shelter, so I think it's a bus stop, but like... A smart oh, bus see. stop. It has so Wi-Fi. You know, it's really cold right now, right? So it's nice and warm inside. We don't, we don't have that. <laughs> you can see like they even, when the air quality isn't good. Oh, it's like quality. a cleaner. Yeah. And like fresh air inside. And they have nice and warm in here and you can sit and wait for your bus. It's pretty nice that they like clean the air because there's a lot of cars in yeah. Seoul. Especially then, if you're waiting for the bus, yeah, you have bus. to wait by the By the road. big road and then yeah. you... Oh, look! You can see if the bus is coming and then all the buses That's that are cool. arriving soon. I've never seen just a camera pointed at where the bus is coming from. Yeah. We have times, but not everywhere. Yeah. We have... Uh... Look at this. This is a UV light. It gets rid of all the, the viruses and stuff like oh. that. <laughs> it sterilizes the air. Yeah, it sterilizes the air, I think. Look! You can even charge your phone. Is this uh, wireless charging as well? I need to charge my phone. I don't have... Actually, you should charge. I have never wirelessly tried to charge my phone. I don't even know if it can. I think it works for me. Yeah, you should try. Well, it is giving off a line. Nope. I don't think I have my charger with me though, but it's really useful. Yeah. Because I have been in places where I was like, oh, I can't charge my phone and it's dying. Yeah, same. And in summer, in summer, it's, it's cool. nice and cool and, and fresh in here. Humid outside. It gets a lot more humid yeah. in, uh, in Korea than in Belgium, right? Yeah, in Belgium it doesn't get that humid in summer. So how long does this stay open? So it starts at 4 a.m. and then it closes at midnight. Okay. So it's open for a very long time. So if you're waiting for the first bus, you can wait in here nice and warm. There are also more buses, I think, or like for longer than in Belgium. Maybe, yeah. I, I think the buses depends. go quite until late at night. Yeah. 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 I think to my hometown on a weekend, we do have buses until like some time past 2. Yeah, 2 like, a.m. But it is for Belgium it's relatively late. One, Most places don't one have One bus this. per hour yeah, until per hour. 2 a.m. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So if you look there, you can see which bus is coming, 26. Like how many minutes are left, but also where it is exactly. So it says that it's three stops away from this bus oh, stop. Oh, I get it. Like the word next to the five means minutes. Minutes. And then the next one is two and then stops away or something. Stops away, exactly. Uh, yeah. And then there's the next bus and then the next yeah. bus. Okay. I see. Which bus are we taking? So we're taking the 2016. Yeah. yeah okay. Green buses, they go like inside Seoul. Oh. And, and you have like the... other kind of buses that go inside districts. And then red buses, they go outside of Seoul as well. The, but like, we took an express bus to get no, no, to Seoul. No, no, not an express bus. Like... The red buses go... Yeah, that doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> the, the red buses, they go like places that are close to Seoul. Like but are not connected. They're not Gwangju. connected by the metro then because the metro goes very are. far away so, yeah but the metro doesn't go everywhere and the buses mm. take more like different routes ah, yeah, yeah. do you feel like there are any differences between the belgian winter and the korean winter i think so yeah because i thought it would be a lot colder but we're having really good weather right now yeah that's true so but usually overall, it's really yeah cold. so overall i've been like oh this weather is great yeah. <laughs> 
but it is like really dry yeah. in uh, in winter here. Both and of I'm, our both of our poor lips mm, are very cracked. <laughs> and because uh, I think the the humidity like does a lot more fluctuates a lot more in. Korea than it does in Belgium. Yeah, that's true. In summers are drier and our winters are wetter, I guess. Yeah, than, than, in, than in Korea. Korea. How many minutes? Two minutes. You have your card? Uh, yep. This metro card has been passed down generations. <laughs> My sister bought this metro card in 2017. Okay. Let's go. Cake. Something like the wifi. Public Wi-Fi secure. We have to open oh. public Wi-Fi free off Seoul and Nikkei home. And ramen. They have windows in the bus. Oh, you can open the window. You can open the window. No, I can't open the window. Oh. Yeah, we don't have that. I wish we had that. What did you think of the bus? I, it was very different. What was different? The Wi-Fi. We talked about so much. Yeah. So Korea has free Wi-Fi in the bus, uh, which we don't have. I think it's so handy because I always use all my data. Mm. And at the end of the month, I'm like, oh no, I don't have data left. But in the bus, I can still check my things because there's free Wi-Fi. What I like about the Korean buses is in Belgium, the buses can change the number sometimes. Even in the same time even. So yeah. in one way, it might be a different number than in the other way as well. But like today, this bus might be bus number 25. Yeah. And tomorrow, it might, might be bus number 11. Yeah. yeah. But here, the bus always stays the same. So the bus route is like pay it on the window which yeah. is really handy i think like where the bus is going exactly. and like where it's you're really gonna and you can always check yeah and then also the buses have a like they say where you're where you are yeah. and then where you like the next stop is gonna be yeah they announce yeah, the they next announce. stop the buttons <laughs> the buttons <laughs> the, the buttons scare me a little because they're big reds and big flash. Red stop. Yeah, big red stop, and I'm like, uh, am I supposed to press that? <laughs> because in Belgium we have the just the bell. Yeah, a yellow one. Yellow for... bell to stop, and then a red bell for like emergencies. emergencies. So in Belgium, if something is wrong on the bus, you can push the emergency red button. Yeah. But when I first came to Korea, it was the same. I was like, this is a red button. Can yeah, I, do not press red button. Can I press it? <laughs> what is this? This is a small restaurant where you can have like some street food, but it's not in the street, it's in the, yeah, subway. It's in the subway. And it's really interesting because there's one side of the restaurant inside the subway and one yeah. side before Outside, the subway. Yeah. People who are not inside yeah. the subway but like nice. didn't pay for the subway they can also eat it's yeah, really nice. handy can i eat that one sure let's try that one 안녕하세요 저희 어묵 두 개요 어묵 두 개네 어묵 두개 여기 네 어묵 두개 여기 있어요 영수증도 네 주세요 and then you just give the card away and the card is gone <laughs> very interesting and you never you never put in a code anywhere no you like, never put in the pin, the code, pin code in korea <laughs> take this you have to take it. No, I was above. shocked by the metal again. Oh, this is not to drink. As well, but you can hold it above like this. It's gonna be very, very hot. It's warm. Mm. It tastes weird. Weird? <laughs> it's like doughy fish. Like the texture is a little like squid-like in that it is like rubbery. Not very, yeah, not very, a lot fish. less, but like, but it's fish. Mm. So when do people eat this? I guess people eat this when they're like on their way to work, like five minutes left before they have to take the subway. They can eat it as snack. You can also eat this in the morning. As when breakfast. I, it's not really breakfast breakfast, but you know, when you're kind of hungry and you didn't have time to have breakfast and you're like rushing to your work and you, you're hungry and you're cold, this is like nice and warm in winter as well. So sometimes when I go to Busan for my work mm -hmm. in the morning in the train station, I eat this. Do people eat it in the summer as well, or is in the yeah. summer like different kind of food as well? Something no, same, more cold. Same food. Okay, same food. 
They also sell like tteokbokki, which is like spicy rice cake. So those kind of food that you can eat quickly. Yeah, now we paid beforehand. But usually when you can stand here, you can just take one out oh. and eat. And then later you show how many sticks you have. And then you can pay like, ah, I have three sticks. So that means I ate three. And then oh, you can okay. pay afterwards. And I can drink this? Yeah, you can drink this. It's like soup, but it's going to be really hot. So careful. Mm. I like the soup. You like the soup? It's not too spicy? No, I think it's very warming the body, I mm -hmm. think. We don't have street food. And no, no. We don't really have street food. And you yeah, usually pay food. first but, and then oh, you yeah, get yeah. the food. We do have well, street food, but it's almost always going to be foreign inspired street food and sometimes in a truck as well i guess yeah, yeah. so if we talk belgian street food it's gonna be fries the soup the soup is very nice do we have bathrooms in the, in the subway, subway station uh, i think so yeah yeah in brussels yeah but we have to pay for it right yeah no free bathrooms in korea all the bathrooms are free it's really nice and you have sometimes you have multiple bathrooms in one subway station if the subway station is really big you can have like a bathroom at exit a and a bathroom somewhere closer to another yeah and like so place. far they've been really clean as well which yeah. is like it's one of the reasons in, in belgium you have to pay for them it's so that they're clean because yeah the fees then go towards the cleaning but yeah and imagine that like you would eat a lot here and then you have to go to the bathroom but you have to pay or there's no bathroom to go yeah, to yeah. that's really that would be really awkward <laughs> yeah. but I, here I like, it's really good i yeah. like that they say bathrooms are like a basic necessity and yeah. you don't have to pay for it it's yeah, part of the it's part of the system. There's so many public bathrooms yeah. everywhere, even in the like, park yeah, and, and even in the like mountains. We were driving and, and it was like, like sure, we have bathrooms in highway restaurants, but they were yeah. also like, it's not the same. No. Yay! So now we are going, where exactly? We are going to Gui station. Okay. Then we're gonna eat lots of oh, yes. yummy oysters, seafood. Yep, 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 yep. And we take a tram or a metro. We're gonna take the metro, but the metro needs to go over the river. So over that's river. why it's now going above. off. Yeah. So that's a, that's a bit crazy. Do you hear that song? Yeah. Right now? It's like a song that says that the metro is approaching. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Uh, there's also this one fun thing. When you're gonna take the subway, at one point there's gonna be like a song inside the subway at the stop. When there's a song, it means that the subway is like crossing another line and there's a transfer station. Oh. But not every stop has a transfer station, so not every stop has a the song. song. <laughs> yeah. Only the transfer stations have the song. Yeah, it's pretty genius actually. Yeah. Also there's a lot of gates everywhere. So yeah. the other line was different, they were more like full gates. Yeah. But like here there's like always two gates. So one on the metro itself and then one on the, on the side platform. of the platform. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. When I was in Belgium and I took the subway, I felt a little bit scared because there weren't any like gates. Gates. Uh... Because I thought I was going to fall. <laughs> <laughs> Arrive. That one pink. Because it's for pregnant women. Oh. And it's good because it's to the side so they can hold the, the oh, bar when they get up. Yeah. And it's close to the door. door as well. And then you also have the yellow ones. Those are for um, oh, for elderly elderly people or yeah, people who have a disability or who or people like with children. Yeah, yeah, I see it on the people with children. No one sits on the seats for the elderly people. I didn't know that in the beginning. So when I first came for my trip, I was like, oh, there are seats here. So I went to sit down and I thought, ah, if elderly people come, well, I I'll will just stand, stand up. up. Oh yeah, and also an arrow on yeah. the. Oh, we're getting off. Yeah, there's an arrow on the which side you. There, they even like show you how far the bathroom oh. is, <laughs> so you don't have to find the bathroom. It's just like okay, down yeah. and then seven seventy meters, meters until the bathroom. Yeah. So sometimes you just run around the station finding one. Trying to find the yeah. bathroom. I love that I can just yeah, your phone. pay with my phone. <laughs> There's also always an ATM in the subway station. Almost always, I think. I don't know if we have that. This is not... But here it would be useful because I think I can get cash. 
from my Belgian cards, like from my visa. I think Korea is trying to give us shock therapy to keep us awake. In Belgium, in the subway, are the subway exits also numbered? No, they do show, they have names sometimes, but never numbers, I don't think ah, so. Ah, okay. Like which street they're gonna be on? Yeah. That, like, if you go up, but yeah. never like exits. Not that I know anyway, exit yeah. like seven or five or... Uh, because in Korea, like in Belgium, they also show the direction like, oh, if you go this way, it's going to be this building or this street. Yeah. But they have numbers. Oh. If you want to meet someone, it's really easy because you can be like, oh... I'm going to be in this subway, but like that exit. At exit yeah. four or something, yeah. There's another, another one. Yeah, I feel like these days they have a lot of new ones. It's also definitely used a lot. The buildings go like... So many tall buildings, yeah. yeah. They go into the sky. Do you also notice how many cafes there are there's so many cafes what did you think of the subway now that we took the subway it was nice <laughs> it was clean yeah it was clean right it was quick special needs i guess you would mm -hmm. say like old people elderly people yeah and i really like the fact that the subway exits have numbers oh, yeah, yeah. because it's easier to find your number yeah, yeah. exactly so it's really easy. And you like double gates. Yes, because I feel safe. Yeah. <laughs> it's nice that you can like use the same card for the bus and the subway. Yeah. Uh, in Brussels, but, in yeah. the one city, everything is one card. A different company, yeah, so yeah, a different yeah. card is, and a different system. Is the whole of Korea just one like system? Yeah. Public transport? Yeah. So okay. except for the trains, that is like KTX or SRT, except for those, it's all one like system. So you can use the same transit card in Seoul, but also in Busan, but also in Daejeon. And so if, in we different take, places. if we take a bus in Daejeon, we can just use the same card. The same card, yeah, but exactly. Not, not the express bus. No. Because those you have to, okay. By the way, how's university? It's going great, I guess. Yeah. I feel like I've finally gotten into where I want to be. Okay. So that's now cool. studying law is like what I want to do. Okay. Which kind of law do you want to do later? So I want to do international law, like more of the diplomacy, yeah. like that kind of thing. What I do like about Korean universities is that when you're in university, you have your major, but then you can choose a number of classes that are not from your major. And I had that in Belgium, but I can, like, I study politics. I could choose between, like, law or history. In Korea, while I was studying communications, I could take, like, classes from the acting or I could take classes from like English literature. So some of my really, really, really fun classes were classes from other majors <laughs> that were just super interesting. So it was nice because I could kind of get a little taste of the other majors as well. I think my major is pretty much like I, la, 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 I, like, la, la, I probably la. can in like my masters take a lot more like subjects that I want, but like the big importance is still that even if I choose different subjects, they have to be like Related. In, or at least yeah. like somewhat useful to my major. I don't think I will be studying any more sciences in my major. <laughs> have you ever been to a Korean university festival? We have these like university like festivals once or twice a year. They invite actual singers and like idols and famous people to come perform. Like how famous? Sai famous. Oh. Like world famous. World famous people. Sometimes. And every university has like their own or is yeah. it just all of them together no, in the no, same no. name? Every okay. university has uh, their own festival. Yeah. And it's a lot of fun. That's cool. Like and it's it's big. It seems crazy because when we have like a live artist at our like we could say that they're famous, but they're not gonna be like Famous world famous, famous. like yeah. we know them in belgium you, they might be somewhat famous and we're like it's pretty cool that they're yeah. here right but we're never gonna have someone that's like like yeah, mega like famous I, yeah there are universities that are really 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 big brussels but it's definitely like a pretty big university and it's generally like all on one campus but in belgium you sometimes have like you know, the whole university is like spread out over the city. Yeah. So this building is university and then house, cafe, house, 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 cafe, house, restaurant, like business this, center. Yeah. like. And then this uni this building is also university and then other stuff. And then this building is also from so the sometimes, university. Sometimes after class, if you have to get to your next class, you have to be on the other side of the city. Yeah. Uh, shall we go and eat now? Sure, okay. let's go. Let's go? Okay. <laughs>